everybody, it's Blue Ducky, and welcome back to another episode of Toy Talk. And Max, the Equestria Girls are back. Yes. From HasCon 2017, this was one of the big reveals. Uh, I was not expecting this at all, were you? Uh, no, and they got a completely new design and uh, style. Yeah, and does this mean they're going to be working on another new movie? I never even watched The Legend of Everfree. After Friendship Games, I was like, uh... I watched it. Did you like it? Yeah. Oh, okay. I still enjoy them. What do you viewers think of that last uh, Equestria Girls movie? Mm -hmm. Um, I have mixed feelings. I'm things I think that are better, but still, I you guys know right away what I'm going to say is the bad about it. The knees. Yeah, the knee. Why do the joints on the the old Equestria Girls? They had two models: the more basic and then the more articulated one why take that joint away from the the knees and the initial line because you know they're only as it f goes further along they're going to remove stuff but the initial just give that knee joint come on i really like the outfits though i think the outfits look awesome now some of the characters i think fared better in the new design than the uh the old like um some standouts to me i think applejack looks really good yeah i like her face uh, Pinkie Pie looks great. Yeah. And it was this um, Sapphire. Sunset Shimmer. So. <laughs> Sunset I'm not a. Shimmer? I'm not a my. I'm not a, a brony or. I I may I I might get there one day, but I'm not there yet. Sunset Shimmer. She looks good. Mhm. Mm uh, which one do you think fared the worst out of the redesigns? Um. I probably Twilight's my least favorite. Twilight. Maybe Rarity too. Those two. I think Rarity looks good. Oh. Mine's Rainbow Dash. Oh okay. And then Fluttershy. I mean, I think she looks all right, but she, oh, I, I like Fluttershy a lot. But you viewers, comment below too. Who do you think is the best, at the redesign, and the one that needs the most work? Mm-hmm. I'm very happy for you Equestria Girl fans, though. Mm -hmm. Very happy for you. I just wish that knee joint. That one one thing. And uh, the cloth quality is a little bit lacking in some areas there. I don't think so. I think their outfits are really awesome. Uh, here are the new Elsa and Anna mm -hmm. um, for the Frozen Olaf's are they limited holiday. limited edition or what? No, these are just... I think these are like the two doll set for disney store okay uh for the new olaf's frozen holiday adventure i forget exactly what it's called mm -hmm. um coming out ahead of some movie i know it's ahead of it's gonna be before some disney movie this holiday season coco maybe yes that's it yeah okay. that's where it's gonna be their outfits look really cool yeah i like uh elsa's especially the fabric looks pretty good quality yeah i mean decent it's not like gonna blow your mind but looks cool i would say it's better than most oh yeah okay yeah. look at all the stitching and details some alina of avalor mm -hmm. i, I love that dress on her it's a singing doll i think mm -hmm. she looks really cute pretty i think this is on sale if you're looking for it, i think it's on sale on disneystore.com i I was looking at DisneyStore.com, and it's now it's called Shop Disney. It's not called DisneyStore.com anymore. Oh, okay. You type in the URL, it still goes there. But I, I was like, am I on the right Disney website? Because I know they have a few. But it's Shop Disney. But if you did DisneyStore.com, you'll get the same place. I like how her um, dress is like uh, based off of her wing leopard. Yeah. It's pretty. Here's a little plushie of Elsa with that new dress design. Yeah. We don't really collect these, but the dolls look nice. I mean, if you're Anna. if you're a fan of the plushies, mm -hmm. I just think if you're going to go like with this type of style, just go with the doll for me personally, but it's nice to have options there. Sven. Mm -hmm. And here's some new characters for the Frozen short. I forget what they're called. <laughs> They're cute, though. Yeah. Which one's your favorite there? Uh, probably the penguin. Yeah. It's very 
you. Do you guys in the comments know uh, the names of those characters? And this just came out. I don't I don't know exactly how it came out. If it's a leak from the artist that worked on it, but this is like a crossover character that would have been in the Monster High Ever After High movie, the Lost movie. Mm -hmm. What do you think of her? Uh, she looks cool. It's a, it's a kitsune. It's like a Japanese fox with like nine tails. I would love to see a doll of this. Yeah. Maybe some awesome uh, viewer or someone out there do a custom doll of this would be really cool. Yeah. I would love to see it. The first person that comes to mind that makes really amazing custom all custom dolls is delightful yes and she listens sometimes yeah. make a doll of this please i want to see or uh well she's making the the ev evolutions but she made a, a nine tails pokemon doll that would be amazing yes that's how i was kind of hinting at but you just spelled it out there yeah. <laughs> thanks Dougie. <laughs> that, i would love to see that i know you viewers would too probably uh here are some Equestria Girl minis, and these are like summer beach themed. Mm -hmm. And these are not getting a reboot because they're doing really good. Mm -hmm. uh, I honestly think they should just focus on this and do like these minis and then do a more detailed um, mini doll with brushable hair. I would love to see. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm, I'm happy for you viewers that want the actual dolls, but I just... I think these are such quality designs. I love the expressions on their face. Yeah. Uh, the only thing that m makes me a little not wanting to collect them as much is the hair is plastic, but it make it looks nice. But the original ponies were brushable. I just would love to see a brushable hair in the style of Shoppies with great hair. They have the joints and everything else. I don't mind the plastic skirts or anything. It looks good. Mm hmm. What do you think? You think I, you just keep I with like, what they're going? I like, I like them how they are. Okay. What, it, what Viewers, I'd love to hear your opinion on that. What do you think? Would you love to see Questry Girl mini dolls with great brushable hair of the style of, or the quality of uh, Shoppies? I would think that'd be amazing. I think they'd fly off the shelf. And then we're down to the viewer comment. Harpsifiz. Oh, please, please, please let them revive Star Darlings. I need them to make a doll of Gemma. She is so incredibly adorable. I need her right now. Piper 2, the real one, not the Wish World. One with normal colored hair. That Leona doll with the brown hair is Wish World. Earth is called Wish World version. Gold hair version is Starland version. Uh, we want to see... a. Uh, the star darlings come back to now when I was preparing the episode I can ducky was right some of those designs were already released and it's kind of weird some areas of the world it was already released sometimes some areas the star darlings are just coming out and then there are some new star darlings in that toy talk episode a few episodes ago so if you want to go back and look at that episode it's kind of mixed. Some were already released in certain regions. Some are coming out now. So it's kind of all over the place with the Star Darlings. But we definitely are fans of the dolls. And we would love to see them come back. Yeah. So, so there are new ones. If you haven't found them before, be on the lookout. And some viewers, although I can't give you the shout out now because I don't remember. But some viewers pointed out that you can get some of those dolls on Amazon right now for very reasonable prices. Mm -hmm. yeah. So so that's the end of this Toy Talk episode. Yeah, we appreciate you watching, all the support. If you have some doll news you want to share or comments, or if you want, even leave in the comments below here, if you have some ideas for some hot topics, because I'm going to try to work on those shortly. And uh, we're planning to do this a little more often. Uh, give a little short episode daily if we can. So, what was your... F oh, what was your favorite thing of this episode? Um, my favorite thing, I have to say... Uh, hmm. 
the Elsa and Anna or the new Equestria Girls or the uh, the minis. I like the artwork for the Kitsune. That was probably my favorite. Oh, oh yeah, that was yeah. your favorite? Yeah. Okay, that was your favorite? Uh, I would say I'm happy the Equestria Girls are coming back. I wish there was more joints, but I'm very happy, so that's my favorite. Yeah. I'm very happy for you fans out there because it's doll lines coming back with fans that's always a plus yes all right thanks for watching guys thank you bye